A digital multimeter is a test tool used to measure voltage, current and resistance. The face of a digital multimeter typically includes four components. A digital display where measurement readouts can be viewed. Buttons for selecting various functions, these options vary by model. A dial or a rotary switch for selecting primary measurement values, these will be volts, amps or ohms and input jacks where test leads are inserted. A multimeter allows us to measure voltage, current and resistance. We stock both manual and auto range multimeters. With a manual range multimeter we need to set the range of values we want to measure. Auto range multimeters allow you to take measurements without having to specify a value range. Test leads are flexible insulated wires red for positive, black for negative, that plug into the digital multimeter. They serve as the conductor from the item being tested to the multimeter. The probe tips on each lead are used for testing circuits. The voltage is measured across a component, so it will be measured by placing the black terminal on the zero volt and the red terminal on the positive volts and reading the display. Whilst voltage is measured across a component, the current flows through the component. To take a current reading, the circuit needs to be broken and the meter inserted. If the meter is placed across a circuit, like it is used to take a voltage reading, a massive amount of current will flow through the amp meter, damaging it and potentially damaging the power source. We can use a multimeter to test for continuity. Continuity is where two parts are connected together. This is particularly useful when trying to debug things like PCBs. For example, we can test whether two pads on a PCB are connected together. If the pads are connected, the meter will indicate this with a buzz.